Tuco and Linda just got back. And we're going to fly the Flightworks Red Bull Stearman. I just had to glue the rudder back on. It came loose. But I caught it. Right, left, up, back, right, left. And the breeze is coming from over here. It's not much, but it's a breeze. I probably should calibrate the throttle. But it should fly fine. Famous last words, it should fly fine. Woo. <laughs> Kind of got my sticks full here. Let's see. For whatever reason, like on some of my planes, when I went to the Dia NX10, my trim settings didn't come in. And this was a plane that that didn't go, because I had a lot of, I think I was out on the elevator, but I can't remember. I just like this steering man. Minutes. Oh shoot, we got a walker. We got to land. Time to stop. We got to land. There we go. We got a walker right there coming in. So we'll brick for the walker. Ready for part two of this flight here. Our walker is way over there, so he's out of the way. And so let's see if we can take off in this taller grass again. Show better take off. Still pitching up. I've got a uh, 3200 four sail all the way to the nose. Trying to be smooth. Time remaining four minutes. Oh well. Just got to remember it's a biplane. When you put on power, it's going to climb. You gotta use the rudder in the churn. You gotta use the rudder in the churn. <laughs> this used to be my trickiest plane to fly. It still might be in that category. <laughs> like a Waco. A Waco flies, flies like a trainer plane compared to a Stearman, it seems. No gyro or anything like that. I just have, a, I just have a lemon receiver in it. Sorry I'm not doing any real air show stuff like the real one does, man, the real Red Bull. Take it over here. See? <laughs> That climb was like half power. <laughs> it was like half power. <laughs> Thing is like a rocket ship. Tower Hobby sold these. I think they were Flight Works. They were called Flight Works. They had this. They had uh, a P38. And they might have had a couple other planes too. They had an extra. And the Red Bull scheme with the chrome prop. You can't, you break that chrome prop, man. You can't get another one. This is my second one. Uh, my original one, I, I Time remaining, two traded it to my buddy Rick that was going to make it into a, uh, a true Red Bull with double ailerons. 
we got the winds coming up. It's still beautiful though. Not bad, not bad. There it is drifting in the wind. You see the chrome prop? Got a fuzzy on my face, head scratch. <laughs> All right, so we get a landing in and we'll call this a flight. Time to stop. Time to start. Time to stop. Ooh, we wiped her out, man. We stalled. I was trying not to stall. I was too far away. Stalled her in. <laughs> like I said, man, the wind came up. It would have been perfect if the wind wouldn't have come up. At least we didn't break the chrome prop. I can't quit on that landing. You see the tree blowing, man? We got a nice little breeze going here. It's probably blowing. I don't know, like seven maybe. Something. Maybe more. All right. Let's see, my wind's coming from over here now. So it's gonna be a crosswind landing. That's all right, we can do crosswinds. All right, let's get her up. It's gonna go up fast. All right, let's get the Red Bull up. There we go. You see me using the elevator when I push it down, when it, cause it, when it goes up and I'm pulling it down. Alright. Time to stop. Time to start. Let it go by me. Time to stop. Time to start. Time to stop. There we go. <laughs> I held her. I held her and then the last minute, man, I just turned into the wind and put her down. There you go. It was a good smooth landing. Man, the winds came up, man. See, the flag's even blowing over there. Oh, well. It was a good flight. It was a fun flight. This plane, man, it's like... It's, uh... <laughs> like I said, man, it's a handful. It's a handful, man. It's not... It doesn't fly like your um, E-Flight, the yellow Sturman. No, it's got a mind of its own, man. It's got like, I don't know, it's just, it's just a, it's a tricky plane to fly. There you see the chrome prop. Your Red Bull, Flightworks Stearman, sold by Tower Hobbies. Good grief, man. This plane's probably eight years old, nine years old. That was some fly I had. I had a, huh, that was the most sticking I've had to do on a plane in a long time, man. But like when that wind came up, man, it's just like, yeah. There you have her. I normally land it like a warbird, but with this grass, man, I'm kind of worried about pitching over. So that's why I kind of float floated more than I normally do. Oh well, Linda and Tuco in the shade. Jeff and the Red Bull Stearman in the sun. We're having fun. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing and becoming part of Team Let's Go Flying. <laughs>